was warm. That's not good. to my channel today we're at Kyoto station but we're going to Kyoto Aquarium um, it's only a 20 minute uh, walk from the station and then there's signs here and there to where to go and this aquarium is supposed to be located near a park or inside of a park so today actually I had all these plans to do something and go to a shrine but today it's raining and the weather is not so good so i thought maybe we can go somewhere where it's indoors so um in this video we're gonna go to the kyoto aquarium but um there's also like i said in the other video that uh, a good time to come to kyoto is to see all the autumn leaves and also actually they have a lot of man this street is really noisy actually they have a lot of um, places that are open at night so a lot of shrines that usually close around five o'clock they're open at night because they light up the leaves and it looks really pretty so my plan today is we're gonna do this aquarium video and then finish it and then there's also a shrine nearby that does the um, outdoor light um, illumination I guess you would say that um, at, at night so we're gonna go there and that I'll probably put that in a separate video and that's the um, Todaji temple and then I'm going to try to go to Kodaji temple where they also have a night illume lights for the uh, temple as well and then we're gonna finish off um, at Gion and downtown Kyoto so this will probably be maybe three or four parts maybe three or four videos and um yeah i guess uh yeah i guess the best time to see these uh they do these like night illuminations during the fall so here's some another sign kyoto aquarium let's go this way at this cool cafe
there's like a shrine in the middle of this small street yeah all right so it's gonna be a little bit of a walk but um i'm trying something new uh i stopped using the uh the wide view angle and this is just a regular view let me know if you like the wide angle view or just a regular angle view i don't know where i'm going now I think i'm lost check the map this Italian restaurant so they got like this bridge up here so you don't need to cross the street all right we made it there's a old train outside this is the aquarium. It's supposed to close at 8.30. And what I've heard is that, that they have a really good dolphin show. So I'm not sure if that's the, I don't know what you'd call it, a dolphin arena. And then you have this huge park over here. And it's raining. Alright, so the tickets were 2200 for per, per person, right? Yeah, so it's about, about $20 for an adult. So they got a dolphin show right now. We gotta go. Whoa. There's Shinkansen over there.
Alright, so we just finished with the aquarium and now we're gonna go to Todaji Temple and, and maybe they'll have the uh, night viewing of the temple and the leaves. And um, what I thought was, I thought that um, the dolphin show was pretty good, but the aquarium is really small and it's really for like little children and, or for like a first date. Um, and it was like, 20 bucks and I thought it was um, it's really expensive but the facility is really nice so I'm guessing all that money goes into the facility there's also like a nice cafe and they seem like they have really good food there um, 
if you were to come here, I would suggest you come here during the day because um, when it's dark, it's you can't really see a lot of things as far as like some of the animals and the cafe and the garden. There's like a nice garden there, and if you come, if you come um, when it's nighttime, you can't really see all of that and enjoy it. So um, I'm gonna go on, on to the temple right now near here, and I hope you enjoyed watching this video and look out for the next video. And thank you for watching. Goodbye.